Hey Bonham families, I'm Cynthia, the parent liaison from Bonham, and I just wanted to share a fun little activity that you can try at home with your little one. And all you need are rocks, so a dish for your paint, some paint brushes, some paint, and any plant you can use a ladybug. So I'm going to start with the red, some black. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start with our base color, which is going to be the red. And you can pick any rock. We'll start by painting the entire thing. See, I let it sit for a couple minutes, and now my rock is dry. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose a smaller paintbrush and we're going to paint the face. So you can pick one of the sides of your rock and kind of start off by creating a little area. And we're going to also add some eyes to it. I'm going to continue to paint all the way around. Next, I'm going to draw a straight line down the middle. Then I'm going to add dots on both sides. Okay, and I'm going to let that dry. I'm going to get some white paint so we can make the eyes. And I'm going to get a smaller brush. So I'm going to make two little white circles right where the face is. You can even give it a little smiley face. Okay, what you can also do is add the little pupils to the eye. And there you go. That is your little rock ladybug. Another bug that I'm going to make is I'm going to make a bumblebee. So beforehand, I went ahead and painted it yellow. It's already dry. And so with the black paint from the ladybug, what you can do is kind of the, sim the same thing. Make a little black area for the face. Be sure to paint all the way around your rock. Next, Paint the black stripes across the top and the bottom. As you can see, our bumblebee is taking shape. Now I'm going to add the white, two white circles for the eyes. And even a smile. And then let it sit for a couple of minutes to dry. And to finish off our bumblebee, I'm going to add just one little black dot for the eye. And there you go. So you have your bee and your ladybug. And these are just two of the mini bugs you can create. Um, you can even use your imagination and let them create their own bugs. And if you have a house plant nearby, you can put your bug in a plant tent.